Culinary Arts at Santiago Charter Middle School. Our class this year had students proving math skills before they learned how to measure their cookie ingredients. Our students helped us make our class how-to video for our chocolate chip cookies. The students learned knife skills and then they turned it into vegetable soup. We made perfect hard-boiled eggs and egg salad tea sandwiches. Students learned how to blanch and roast veggies to try carrots three ways. And students and parents volunteered at back to school night to sell our culinary cookbook and hand out homemade muffins. They researched salads and dressings to make salad their way, experimenting with different types of fruits, vegetables, dressings, and toppings. Here are some of the salads that our students created this year. They even made ranch dressing. And topped it with flaming hot Cheetos. Seventh graders ended the year with a cookie contest, judged by our own teachers and staff. We had 14 different cookies from two different class periods, and the winners were our rainbow sugar cookies and double chocolate kiss cookies. That was one of the winners, and here is the other one. The class built community relationships over the semester. Working with Waste Not OC at Catella Grill, we donated approximately 75 pounds of food to Mary's Kitchen each week. We also started the Family Nutrition Series Cooking Nights, inviting families to join us for lessons and a cooking class. There is instruction in English and Spanish, there's great food and activities for all ages. And it was hosted by our culinary students. Students volunteered all year in different capacities. We worked the OHG Farm to Table Dinner at Chapman University, where our culinary students served tray past appetizers, and a gourmet dinner to over 200 members of our community. It was a great night. They are really looking forward to next year. And Dr. D even got his hands on some of our culinary experts for a meal supporting local charities. As our seventh graders move on in their wheel of electives, our eighth graders work to gain a 100% success rate for their food handler certification. And don't forget to sign up for our next family nutrition series that takes place Thursday, December 12th from 5.30 to 7 p.m.